guys, good morning. Today is Monday the 27th and tomorrow is my mom's birthday. So I thought I could vlog this week because it would be a fun one. I don't really know how we're gonna do it, how I'm gonna be able to vlog everything. And there's so many things that I want to do, but we will see what happens. Tomorrow is my mom's birthday, is the 28th, and we're going on a trip Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And I'm so I'm so happy. I made some breakfast. I actually, if I'm being honest, I wanted to go to Starbucks for like breakfast. And then I was like, Danny, like you have been spending a lot of money lately. Like you guys, I bought a running shoes, not because I want to run, but because I feel like my shoes are not like the best quality. And sometimes my feet hurts because of that. And I decided to buy one to invest in some shoes and they're kind of expensive so I did that and I also need to day to finish up my mom's gift i'm gonna do something diy and i want to also buy buy her some flowers and stuff like that so it will be cool she will be staying with us tomorrow like the whole day and i'm so excited to spend the whole day with my mom i don't know i also wanted to say this because i've been getting some questions on my dms and it breaks my heart to see that you guys are struggling so bad with recovery and I got the question of how I stop like fearing food and stuff like that. And honestly, the only way that you can stop being afraid of food is by actually eating it and then realizing that nothing happens. And also with all the pain that I've been dealing with lately with my back, with my neck, right today it's my neck a little bit, but I'm trying to just breathe through it and be like okay it's fine we're not gonna focus on that if we focus on the pain then the pain will be more what you focus on grows so i'm not gonna focus on it but what i've realized with all the pain that i've been dealing with and everything is just like oh my god like really my health is the most important thing and like honestly like gaining weight losing weight whatever your body will change your whole life and like life is too short like literally it's too short to be worrying so much about food which is something that we actually need to survive and food is super yummy like just trying new things is super yummy and you only live once and you've got to live your day to day your day to day life and just in the present moment that's what i'm doing right now just like living my day living my life and just enjoying it and i don't know i feel so happy and so good in my recovery right now that i i just i can't even explain to you how happy and how free i feel right now so i encourage you to do the same i promise it gets better if you keep trying your best and if you keep doing what you're supposed to do. But yeah, anyways, uh, today we're gonna actually, I'm really trying to look for something because I want to do like a scrapbook for my mom. And I'm like, damn, like I really don't know what to do and how to do it. And I'm gonna give you some updates on my health a little later on because I really want to see if I can find something for my mom so that I can start doing it because I'm running out of time. I just have today, but I just got some lab work and I got like literally stop in here, in here, in here and in here <laughs> because my blood didn't want to come out and that was rough. It was so rough. I cried, but not because of the blood work, because yeah, I hurt, but I didn't cry because of that. I cried because I just felt like frustrated with my health and like, I don't know what's going on and whatever. My blood work all came back super good. And I have an neurologist appointment on March 13, which hopefully will come sooner than later to see if something's going on. I wanna get an EMG done and I also got some blood work for literally everything and it came back super good. I don't have any autoimmune disease. My blood work was all pretty good, so I'm very happy about that. Mm. I'm gonna eat breakfast and I'll see you guys later. Okay, I promise it's the same day, but I just changed. Um, I went to Michael's and I bought this little notebook and I'm actually going to paste the pictures in here. It's a little like a scrapbook for my mom and these are the pictures that I print. There she is. Like we have like a lot of pictures with her and I'm gonna try and look up like different phrases or quotes and stuff like that and I'm just gonna 
paste that in there. And I also went to Target to see if I could find anything for her. But if I'm being completely honest, she's very complicated when it comes to like gifts. So I decided to buy a bag for like my scrapbook and a gift card. So we have the gift card, this, the scrapbook, and I'm going to buy her flowers tomorrow and we will see what we, what we will end up doing tomorrow. But if something, I will invite her out for lunch. I am not sure yet if we're going with like a friend. I don't know that yet, but I'll definitely let you guys know. And I'm gonna work on this right now. And I'll show you guys the end product of my little scrapbook if I finish today. I really hope I can finish today because her birthday is tomorrow, okay? Like I actually do need to finish today. And I put some cream in here because my neck has been painful but now it's kind of burning because i put the biofreeze and if you know what the biofreeze is biofreeze it literally like i don't know it feels weird but still we're gonna we're gonna do this okay <laughs> i'm excited i really want to make it work today i'm watching otter bangs and this is how it looks like i really want to do some like hearts and stuff like that but this is so far. I think it looks pretty good. Um, I think so. And I'm so happy with the end product. So like, why not? I wrote little things and I also like put the pictures. I don't know. I freaking love my mom so much. And you guys have no idea how much I love her. So I think it's pretty. I am just gonna decorate it a little bit more. Um, while watching Outer Banks and that's it. Mm, I'm going to be honest, I lost track of time and I got extremely hungry for some reason. I decided to make a very quick lunch, like literally took me like two minutes because I'm literally starving. I'm making a grilled cheese in here, so I'm waiting for it to go out, out but I have some egg and I have tomato and carrots and pickles and i'm going to dip my thinking on my grilled cheese on ketchup that's gonna be a very quick lunch i don't have any meat out of the freezer so that's not cool i don't have any cooked rice i don't have anything i don't know what i'm doing uh today's monday so excuse me okay quick lunch is sir freaking love my ex look at how that looks like it's so good Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna have lunch. I'm gonna still watch Otter Pinks. Oh my gosh. My neck has been painful a little bit, but it's okay. We're trying to calm down on that. The weather is not really cool today, but look who's here. The princess is here. My little baby. I love you. Hi guys, I'm back. Mm, I went to the mail because I thought that my shoes were here, but they're not here, okay? They're not here. I don't know why I got a message saying that they were here because they're not, okay? I'm gonna have popcorners now because I was craving them. They're so good. These are the, the sweet ones. The best. And I'm also gonna have a yogurt. This one is strawberry. That's it. Mmm. Look at my new anillos. They're so cute. That's it. See you later. Guys, we're gonna watch Otter Banks for the rest of the evening. My mom is kind of tired, so that's what we're gonna do. I'll see you tomorrow. Lasagna. Oh no. Me gusta muy Nada. No? No. Ay, Daniela. Hi guys, good morning. I'm getting ready because 
I told you our friend or my mom's friend invited us for breakfast so we're getting ready my dad and my brother they're gonna be working so they're not coming but it's just gonna be my mom our friend and I and then after that we're gonna go to the pool and to the sauna to relax a little bit at my gym and then after that I don't know maybe we will come home because tomorrow no because tonight we're gonna go and watch ant-man yeah ant-man very yeah my leg my leg no my hair has been very painful today but i'm just trying not to think about it because i don't want to ruin my mom's birthday so i'm just gonna try and relax and just breathe through it maybe take some pain meds because i really don't know what else to do at this point with this pain uh, i just gotta wait until i have my appointment with the neurologist and i have an appointment with an emg for my leg my arm pain was all of a sudden i don't know what happened or why it started i literally did nothing the day that it started so i don't know what's going on but we're gonna try not to think about it and just breathe through it and have an amazing day okay we're gonna go for breakfast let's go she looks so pretty look at her shoes my dad that's look his good. gift si se ven she's the best the best ever guys I also forgot to show you that I gave her um, these flowers. These are her favorite flowers, is tulips. And I gave her the notebook and she cried seeing it. See? She cried and it's so cute. Maybe I'll show you later because I feel like we're late. Okay, now let's go. actually went to Target and we bought a couple of things for my mom because I gave her a gift card and now I'm gonna get ready because we're gonna go into the pool and the sauna and the jacuzzi and we're gonna have a great one my neck is very painful right now like I really don't want to cry right now but it is very painful and I don't know what's going on <laughs> so I'm bringing it. I want you to know how I feel showered and now we're gonna get ready we're gonna put on the same thing then we're gonna go home have lunch and then we're gonna go and make our nails and our toes for free for free and um for free the picture but we do we do have to like pay the manicure if you know what i mean whatever um yeah that's it then we are going to the scene now
Okay, so we had lunch and now we're gonna do mani and pedicure before going to the cinema. This is the before. We're gonna pick the color. I have like turmeric in here because I just had lunch, but it's okay. they have an early appointment because this is too much try not to cry yes it's my mom's birthday but it's just too much hey guys good morning um it's the next day i had to stop recording tomorrow yesterday because my arm was hurting a lot my mom bought me some it was like it is like patches that you put on your shoulder and she put it over here Hi uh, guys, I've been wanting to see. I've been wanting to see if like I have any inflammation or anything, but where it hurts, it's right here, and it goes like from my neck, like even here hurts, and all of this goes straight here, and then I feel numbness in my arm, um, and my hand. Oh, here are how my nails look like. I didn't get to show you yesterday. I actually ended up calling the neurologist to see if they have an early appointment, but they don't. So I just need to wait. And honestly, I could go to the emergency room to see if they can help me with anything, pain meds, something like that. But honestly, the ibuprofen, the Tylenol has not been helpful at all. Like it just doesn't do anything but um even if it hurts and everything i do try to remain positive and at the same time i know for a fact that worrying about it and like being sad and crying and stuff like that like sometimes yeah i need to cry and i need to like get my feelings out but worrying about it and everything is not gonna help me my doctor the doctor that i went to she helped me a lot like mentally she saw that i was struggling a lot uh, crying and stuff like that because of the pain and worrying about what could be so she actually told me like okay the best thing that you can do and the, the thing that I want you to get out of this appointment is to remain calm and to be positive and let us worry about you you don't have to do this you don't have to worry about yourself like you don't have to worry about your health um and what could be and instead let us doctors worry about it so i'm just gonna breathe try to calm down because i know like even like getting nervous and getting mad or sad or crying or like you know um that's not gonna help me so i'm just gonna try and do that today i just shower i've been loving my cold showers as i told you and um i got ready and i don't know what i'm gonna do today i need to pack because we are leaving tomorrow and i have not packed anything we also didn't um sing happy birthday to my mom yesterday so i'm gonna do we are gonna do that today when she comes back from work and i think her friends are gonna invite her out for lunch so that's cool i just want her to feel as much love as possible because she truly deserves it. I freaking love my mom. She's like the best person ever. So yeah, I will see you guys later whenever I do something else. Hi guys. Um, honestly, I have not done much. I wanted to show you, but I didn't, but I messed up my nails just trying to do something at the kitchen. And I didn't tell my mom because she will literally be so mad. She told me yesterday, you better take care of your nails. And I didn't. I messed them up. So I went back to the salon. Fuck. I messed them again. This is so bad. You guys, I don't know why I do this, but I messed it up again. But I also went to shave my legs. And that's everything I have done so far. Remember I told you guys that I was waiting for a package? Well, finally got it. I bought myself some shoes. I don't know why. Because I wanted to, you know? I wanted to, like, try them. Because I have seen a lot of good comments about 
this brand and I really wanted to try it and I never buy anything for myself so why not and I've also been working on some brands and like filming some content so that's what I did and I still need to like edit that and I'm also packing for my trip um, for me packing is so easy because I don't really care that much about like Oh, having the best clothes and whatever like I just as long as I have clothes to wear I don't really care these shoes actually I don't do it for like the brand and because of like they're expensive guys but I don't do it for the brand or or because um, they're like fancy or stuff like that no I do it because you guys know I have been dealing with a lot of health issues and one of those is like my leg pain and sometimes I do feel like the shoes that I wear really affect me and like how I walk and stuff like that so I decided to try I don't really know how to say it but I think it's Hoka Hoka I, I don't know thought I could do a little unboxing of my new shoes here they are um I'm gonna try them on and I'm gonna let you guys know how they feel and everything my mom told me that this was way too like big so I don't know if it's gonna be uncomfortable or right for me but we will see I also finally got the call for the MRI and I'm gonna have a brain MRI on the 23rd of this month so i have like i already have like four doctor's appointments this month and i don't know i've been feeling a little bit down with all of this just because i feel feels kind of sad that i don't really made any goal for this month because i don't know how it's gonna go literally my only goal this month is to stay present and live my day-to-day -day life my day-to-day -day yeah live my day to day i don't know how to explain it but i just i have a lot of things going on and i can't really put like any goal of like doing yoga or stuff like that every day because some days it just hurts too much to do even that <laughs> i don't want to cry or even read because sometimes i just feel like super fatigued and not even reading um makes me feel good so i've just been like living my day to day as it comes I could actually do a goal of like watching the whole Outer Banks or stuff like that because that's the only thing that I've been doing lately. Honestly, just watching Netflix it cheers me up and it makes me think about something else. And I've also been um, listening to the podcast of Crime Junkie so that I can distract myself with something else. I don't know. I used to read a lot of like personal development and like books um i mean like yeah like how to be a better person or like how to be healthier or like workout routines and stuff like that and that just seems so dumb for me right now that i'm dealing with all of this it's just like i just i just want to feel okay and do what makes me feel happy i don't really care about the hustle culture and like do as much as possible and like work out as much as possible and like lose weight as much as possible like i, I just don't give a shit anymore i just i just want to feel okay uh so it helps me to like just i don't know distract myself so that's everything for now uh for the rest of the day we're just gonna i think we're waiting for my mom to come home so that we can sing happy birthday and then i'm gonna pack because tomorrow we're going on our trip i'm probably gonna vlog it maybe that would be cool and that's gonna be all my mom is gonna get super mad about this but it's okay i will tell her that i went and she will laugh about it but yeah that's everything